expenses. So a little double duty on that one. Baby Dragon trying to help set the funnel along a little bit more. Um, but unfortunately, that Tesla farm uh, poses a little bit more difficulty here. Now, I'm curious to see if he's going to use this warden to actually take out the town hall. And because we have the siege barracks, I'm going, I suspect so. We have the siege barracks. So this is ensuring that we actually take down the threat of the poison bomb by using the warden. But it is so painstakingly slow to move along, which is why we drop this rage. It keeps it alive. Also keeps those uh, healers kind of raged up, keeping that warden alive. But it also helps speed him up, which is huge. We need to get this forced and moving along. So that's exactly what he does. Siege barracks down, king cutting across. So we're not going to have the benefit of him moving along the outside edge. Not necessarily a terrible thing. We do have the ice golem Ooh. tanking. But can that P.E.K.K.A. actually take out the scatter shot? Oh, come on, P.E.K.K.A. He's going back to the outskirts. And the ice golem switching back in. Oh, this is not coordinating the way Eve Carlito had really hoped for. King moves along. That scatter needs to be taken down. And those wizards are not. Oh, ho, ho. maybe they are going to be enough with that freeze and the addition of the hogs coming out of that siege barracks. Okay, we get what we need in that compartment. And most importantly, as we push through into the center of that base towards the back end, We've got tons of power left over. These super wizards are alive and kicking and fighting, as are the P.E.K.K.A.s, because we've got the king taking the lead here, doing that mighty tank work. Royal Champ just barely set on the board, and we are almost done with this one. Back end multi, not going to pose an issue to stop this. We've got two freezes left over that theoretically could be swagged because with the Royal Champ and her Seeking Shield, she's got enough in her to get every single building knocked down on her lonesome. He does drop one practically, ensuring that the Royal Champ has what she needs, launches off that Seeking Shield, and just for good measure, drops that final freeze down to give it everything we need moving along 20 seconds left to go i i gotta give it to carlito a lot of teams will want to swag when they think they can but why risk it when you could come down to a time issue carlito playing the smart safe move and securing the three star we've got team elevate in this one going two for two what's going on gar how are you good to see you you tune in right when you're talking about seeking out boobs in real life. <laughs> yeah, but are you going around posting like like 